Now, we followed your, your career in terms of the, the, the apprentice and in, inspiring people. You're, I did a talk at my son's school about mm -hmm. a month ago for Careers Day, going in, and basically it was, it was seminars, talking to teenagers who were going to yep. be leaving school and, and, and what have you. And one of the things that I found really interesting was some of them are very clued up and they have very keen and clear ideas as to where they want to go. Others, not so much. And you feel, as I do really, we have to get teenagers in hand and not just it's not just about reading writing and arithmetic yeah. it's about educating them about the world out there yes I mean I work with something called Barclays Life Skills which does exactly that and we're actually at the moment focusing on helping parents because seven in ten parents say they're worried about their future career for their kids and 68% admit that they really don't know what options there are for their kids when yeah. they leave school and we all know that the biggest transition we will ever make in our lives is leaving education and going to work mm -hmm. so how do we equip our kids with the right skills that they need to get the jobs that they want mm. And the website helps parents put in, you can sit with your child and you put in all of their different personality traits, things that they like, and it will yeah. give you pointers to the careers that you want. Mm. Because uh, the other research was that 54% of young people rely on their parents to point them in the right direction oh. of their careers. But if they don't know what careers you can have, it's very yeah. difficult. Yeah. And also it shows you how to help your kids write a really good CV, mm. how to interview really well, how to write a great mm. covering letter, how to build... Well, we don't do... Should be um, on the national curriculum, should Well, it yeah. used to be, but it isn't anymore. And, you know, there's 400 and, sorry, 943,000 young people that are not in employment, not in education and not learning anything. So mm. it's all of our roles. And what happens when you bring together a business, young people, parents, educators um, and the government and you work mm. together, you can find the solution. Absolutely. And there's such talented kids out there that uh, it is just a matter of just pointing in the right direction.